here with special guest Jamie Ziegler. She is a builder, designer, realtor extraordinaire, and she has a beautiful home for sale that's really unique. I'm so excited to talk to you all about it. Stay tuned in today's video. Okay, so the home that you have that is for sale that you built and designed and everything, it's in Terracia. Now, I don't really sell in Terracia, but I wanted to show the public this unique opportunity. So awesome. first, first tell us like about Terracia. Great. So Terracia is located right by the Skyway Bridge. So if you know where the Skyway Bridge is, it's the gateway that takes you to Tampa, St. Pete. Um, it's also really close to US 19, 301 and 275, which takes you to Apollo Beach, takes you to Ruskin. Uh, you know, the, the other part of Tampa, and you can get to Sarasota as well. Okay. Terracia is an awesome island. There's about 400 and so homes total that are probably on Terracia Island. Oh, that's it. I thought yeah. it was bigger. Okay. Yeah, it's not. But it's 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 a sanctuary for a lot of birds, animals. It's right there on the water. Oh. It's close to everything. It's great. It's yeah. like a peninsula. If you look at the map. It is. A little bit. It is. Um, and but you can get large chunks of land out there, too, that are very close to the city, which is really beautiful about it. Which you're on five acres. I am Which on five is acres, yes. a nice private yeah. lot. So the unique thing about your property is it's all steel built. We don't see a lot of it's. What do you call it? So a lot of people want to say that it's a metal building. I'm like, a metal building is what you get from Home Depot and park your your uh, your tough, you know, like your lawnmower in it. <laughs> this, this is, is way red iron. iron steel. It is. It's a very it's a very industrial grade of steel. So if you think about what the skyscrapers are built out of, or what industrial commercial buildings are built out of, or um, condominiums in downtown, they're built out of steel. They don't build them with stick and frame. It's built out of steel. Yeah. It looks like it's gonna. Well, based on the video that you have that we're going to share and that you're going to see it looks like it could live through a hurricane and it looks super 250 solid 50 mile an hour hurricane winds so it's built per miami dade standards it's it's beefed up and it's built up per my per miami hurricane standards and yeah. your insurance and your overall living expenses are really efficient yes. my so in 2000 uh so coming up here in 2024 and 2025 flood insurance is going to be mandatory for people in florida right now so kind of sad but even if you have, own a house in cash it's going to be mandatory so right now what i am paying which is great because it's an assumable flood policy mm -hmm. as long as it's through one of the government um, insured entities i'm paying 437 dollars a year for flood insurance based which, upon how i built the home which is probably the bottom <laughs> of the barrel in terms of low low premium right so um, right. that's amazing. So yeah. your cost of living is like really great. It that's is. Awesome. Well, it I'm is. excited to share this video. So check it out. Thank you. Welcome to 435 Terracia Road in Terracia, Florida. I am actually the owner, I am the builder, and I am also the realtor of this home. A little bit of interesting information about this house is that it is a metal home. It is a very modern steel home. I wanna say it's a steel home, not a metal home. And the thing that makes this very unique is that it is built to withstand 250 mile an hour Hurricane Miami-Dade standards, the winds. It is essentially fireproof or fire resistant. It is termite resistant. So the finished floor elevation on this is 9.275. It was actually brought up from 4.25. So it is in a flood zone. However, my flood insurance on this is about $435 a year. So it's very inexpensive. The beautiful thing about this is that I use this as a show home. The spray foam that's up at the top, it has been painted to where I like it. I use this to have people come in so they can see where the purlins, the girts, how footers are placed. There's five rows of rebar. This is a monolithic slab and the footers go down about five and a half feet down into the concrete. I, if I was gonna stay here long-term or suggest this for somebody else, I would do a drop panel ceiling or I would do a tongue and groove ceiling in this as well, which would finish it off really nicely. But I did choose the windows the way that I did because the inside marries the outside. So out here you have the outdoor living space that opens up into the inside. It's great for entertaining. We have great parties. We have uh, great entertainment capabilities at this house. I built this to have an 8,000 gallon koi pond. 
Uh, what I wanted to do with this originally, or what I see happening with this with the new owners, is putting a pool out here and caging this whole thing in or putting a pool out that way. With 5.1 acres, you can put a pool pretty much anywhere you want. Thanks for coming by today. I look forward to seeing you guys in the near future. Hopefully you'll come by and check out 435 Terracea Road. It is very close to the Skyway Bridge, literally two minutes to the Skyway Bridge. I love to go kite surfing there. You would enjoy it too. Very close to Sarasota, Bradenton, and Tampa is also super close. So have a great day. Thanks for coming by and seeing me.